Hello everyone and welcome for the return of Rome campaigns. So I will start the gameplay for these special campaigns for the new DLC released today for Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition. I will start with the Roman campaign, Trajan. And for Trajan, let's see. I will read it. Trajan from 89 to 117. Marcus Upius Trajanus claimed the ranks of the legions while the emperor Domitian's tyrannical rule tarnished the Roman Empire's glory. When circumstance elevates him to the throne as Emperor Trajan, he inherits a helm on the brink of disaster. Will resourcefulness, virtue, and military might be enough to save Rome and lead it to its historical zenith? Or will the Roman Empire collapse four centuries before its time? In this campaign, you play as the Romans. So Trajan, Trajan, I believe that maybe it's Trajan, Tra Marcus Ulpius Trajanus, will be the personality that we will play here. So the first scenario, Legates and Legions, it contains one specific achievement where if we finish it in under 10 minutes, we get achievement. So it should be really good. I'm very excited. I'm very happy to play it. Uh, that's a very, very cool setting. It's amazing to play a new Roman campaign. After so many years, the last Roman campaign that was released for Age of Empires was back in the expansion, the Rise of Rome from Age of Empires 1. So let's play. Legates and Legions on Heart. My grandfather once told me of the age of Augustus, the emperor who found Rome a city of brick and left it one of marble. Guided by his virtue and prudence, Augustus's empire reached new bounds, a vast constellation of cities spanning the Mediterranean and beyond. Its prosperity and happiness were the envy of an otherwise bitter, cruel world. Seven decades, ten emperors and countless civil wars later, that golden age is a distant memory. Marred by corruption, the constellation that once lit the world is now little more than a faint and fraudulent zodiac. Yet there are those among us who still believe in Rome. In my youth, I followed my father's and grandfather's footsteps into the legions. Twenty years later, I am Marcus Ulpius Trianus, commander of the Seventh Legion and a veteran of Emperor Domitian's northern wars. The aristocrats of the Senate despise Domitian for his unwillingness to bend to their whims, but he treats his legions well. Now, he calls on us to quash the rebellion of one Saturninus, a provincial governor styling himself emperor. A lifelong military man, I know all too well that soldiers' blood is the currency of rich men's power plays. But when Rome calls, I must go. I will march north to see that this civil war ends before it has even begun. Amazing. The art for Return of Rome is amazing. The art team uh, gets a 10 uh, out of 10. Very good. Very well done. Right. Defeat the rebel raiders or Saturninus. Domitian must not be defeated. Trajan's research to the Bronze Age and a population limit of 50. Ooh. We are used to 200, 150, so it's 50. Okay. Uh, very unusual for you to pursue, but very good. Roman towers are cheap. Use them to fortify yourself against early attacks. You only need to defeat one of your two opponents. Uh, do not forget about Domitian, especially on harder difficulties, he will need your help to hold off Saturninus. 
send troops to recruit the Roman legions scattered around the map. Not only will they swell your ranks, but they will also provide Domitian with much needed upgrades. That's very good. Okay, we need some scouts. Uh, I need to gather uh, the most important information as soon as possible because we will have uh, not a lot of time to finish this scenario. Traja, uh, one red controls a small camp and a modest force that is poised to either support the emperor or clean out the raiders scattering around about the countryside. Emperor Domitian, two purple, controls the northwestern region of the map with an army of swordsmen and archers. Mm. Northwestern. Okay. The provincial governor, governor Saturninus, five scion, leads the rebel insurrection from his holdings in the northeast. Mm. He will merciless attack Domitian with force of infantry and mounted units. Saturnino has sent the rebel raiders for blue to waylay any supplies or reinforcements heeded Dominician's way. His axemen, slingers, and chariots are numerous and widespread, but less well equipped. Okay, uh, defeat either enemy player. Okay, uh, we have the two enemies, the blue and the cyan. And Dominician must not be defeated. Hmm. Yeah, we must see. I believe that maybe, maybe can be more easy if we try to rush to Emperor Domitian and aid him against Saturninus. Let's see. Uh, we are Romans, by the way, so we have very good infantry. They are very powerful. We are at the Bronze Age, so we got at least the short swordsmen available. Uh, along with that, we probably can try to make some chariots. I'm afraid we do not have that much of resources. Alright, let's go. Treachery and madness threaten Rome. Can I count on you to save her treasure? These lands are awash with rebel scum. Clean them out! And rally the nearby legions to crush this traitor. The emperor has always treated us well. We will not abandon him now. Many thanks, treasure. These reinforcements were sorely needed. Our Emperor needs us! Pack your things and march on the double! Well done! I see that you are a man to be counted upon, Trajan. Civil wars. Let us teach this rebel governor a lesson. With these forces behind me, and you, of course, we shall be invincible. You 
Five minutes, we don't have much time. I am here to end your unjust reign. I'm under attack! Send help to parry this assault quickly! Centers, we will collaborate. The rebels are crushed. Yeah, no, 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 that was not good. It's taking much more than expected, but still very good. Treachery and madness threaten wrong. Can I count on you to save them? These lands are awash with rebel scum. Clean them out and rally the nearby legions to crush this traitor. The Emperor has always treated us well. We will not abandon him now. Okay. Many thanks, Treasure. These reinforcements were surely needed. Our 
Emperor needs us. Pack your things and march on the double. Well done. I see that you are a man to be counted upon, Trajan. I'm under attack! Send help to parry this assault, quickly! I can. Very good. Send those rebels' heads my way. I shall use them to decorate my camp. Very good, that time. That's all they can say. Tired and civil wars. Let us teach this rebel governor a lesson. With his forces behind me, and you, of course, we shall be invincible! Achievements unlock it. Ooh, and a Roman victory. Haha, <laughs> that's pretty amazing. We Romans say that fortune favors the bold. But how does it decide between two valiant men? The question puzzled me as my men dragged Saturninus before our merciless emperor. I wonder what his last thoughts were. Did he regret not anticipating that my legions would reach the front in time? Did he curse fortune for the unprecedented January thaw that prevented his German allies from crossing the Rhine? 
It matters not. The answer died with him. But our Emperor's anger endured. From the day of his coronation, Domitian had been a firm and bold ruler. But the Senate despised this friend of the legionary and the commoner. When Domitian's latent paranoia began to consume him, his wrath engulfed the Empire like a raging wildfire. Countless arrests followed in the wake of the war. Senators who had opposed him were executed like common criminals. When the court could bear it no more, the Emperor was assassinated. Whoa, yeah, so we helped him, and now he's already dead. Alas, that was pretty amazing, very intensive, uh, 60 units kill, that's very cool. And the path fighting is delicious, it's very good, very soft, so easy, so sweet, very good. Um, yeah, a bunch of food that we got, among them with some gold. Yeah, and yeah. Okay, that was pretty great, and that was kind of quick play, but very good. Uh, a very, very welcome way to start this new Age of Pearls 1 inside Age of Pearls 2. Let's check the map. Um, hmm. Yeah, we could try to go after him. Mm, yeah. It would be doable, I guess, but still, they are very strong, very strong army. I would need to accumulate all of my units, probably. I'm not entirely sure if that would be better for me. Oh, that's that is the wolf. And yeah, uh, I believe that's the way of going. And yeah, very happy we made it. GG, folks. Thanks for watching. <coughs> And I see you next time.